Hey guys, this is 3X, and obviously I am wearing my glasses, which I never do. However, I really wanted to film this video and get it up because I feel like I haven't filmed in a really, or not filmed in a really long time. I haven't been putting up videos as regularly as I usually do, and I'm starting back at school soon, so I think I might as well get as many videos as I can before school starts. So anyways, I'm in my glasses today because um, I don't have any more contacts, and I'm getting more tomorrow, but... I wanted to film this video before then, so glasses it is. However, my glasses tend to fit with the theme of this video pretty well. Um, today I'm doing the what's on my iPhone tag, and um, I just got my iPhone. However, I think the apps I have in it now are probably going to stay on there, like plus or minus a few, and I'll talk about that, I guess. But um, I'm just going to get into it. So This is my iPhone. I have the iPhone 4, the white iPhone 4. Um, I don't have Siri because I think it's useless. Um, and my case is by Griffin, if you see that. And I'll have, like, screenshots of the apps over here, or the apps, some of the apps. Not all of them, but some of them, if um, I can. And it's, like, almost looks like a pink bumper, but it has a clear part on the back that keeps the back protected, as well as a little camera hole, so, yeah. And then you can already see my little image, this is Kai um, and this is he is from XOK which is a Korean band and he's my favorite member he's not my favorite Korean star but um, I love him and I decided to I, I decided he was worthy of gracing the cover of my iPhone so that's my screen uh, lock screen I have my passcode I'm not gonna show you and then you make it to the first page of apps. I like to keep all my apps in folders. I'd like in four folders at the top of the screen. I do it on the same, on the second screen over here. Um, but this here, this um, image is from popcutie.tumblr.com, which I'll link both of my images below if I can find them. So you can download them as well if you want to. Um, this is Maya. I think her name is Maya. Maya or Mana, don't correct, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, um, Honda, which she is a Gyaru model, um, and she just is gorgeous, and this picture is adorable, so that is my screensaver. I don't know if you can see that, it's like, and I'll have previews up at the corner that you can see things better. And then down here on this little bar, I have Safari, phone, messages, and then I have Dragon Dictation, which you download, and basically, let's see, I'm recording a video. You record and then it actually does a really good job of telling you, writing down what you said. I, I'm really impressed with this app because it does a really good job of it. But And then you can send it or tweet it, email it, um, Facebook it, etc. So it's really handy if you don't feel like typing, texting. Um, and then I, my first folder over here is photography because it's probably the, one of the my favorite things about the iPhone is the camera, especially that it has a front facing camera. Um, I am a self-proclaimed, excuse, excuse my French, cam whore, and um, I just love taking pictures of myself. I always take pictures of myself. You can ask Candace. When I didn't have an iPhone, I took her iPhone, took pictures of myself. So um, I'm obsessed with taking pictures of myself. So I have it's my own photography folder. Um, I have the camera app, and then I have Photo Wonder, which is um, my favorite photo editing app for the Android and the iPhone. It is available for Android. Um, all my apps are free, by the way. I haven't paid for any of these apps. Um, and it has edit, collage, and then snap. And the editing features are just really nice. I guess I can't show you, but it has beautify, um, skin, perfection, blemish fix, red eye fix, um, slim, whiten, and a bunch of other things. It's really, 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 really nice. So I really like that one. And then I have pick stitch which I use for mostly for Instagram. I do have an Instagram which I'll talk about later but um, it just has like tons of different I'm like scrolling the wrong way but let's get back. Tons of different ways to collage photos and then um, I have the photos app which shows you my photos. This is like a photo of my home screen. Oh, sorry. So, and then my next little folder is entertainment. Um, the first thing I have on here is Viki, and Viki is um, a sort of like Hulu or Netflix for your phone. I guess I should get the Netflix app, but um, Viki is more of a Korean slash Japanese slash Chinese drama kind of Hulu. Sort of like Drama Fever, if you know what that is, but um, it's a free app, 
and you get all the Korean and Japanese and Chinese dramas with English subtitles, which are my favorite things to watch. So it's nice having that on my phone so when I can bo get bored, I can watch Korean dramas, which I can't watch them anywhere else um, on my phone. So. And then I have the YouTube app, which is self-explanatory. I have Mobile RSS, which I use for looking at my Google Reader subscriptions. That's how I follow blogs. Um, so this is handy if I want to go through and look at blogs. I don't know if you can really see that, but it shows you text and images and everything. It's really nice. So I have that one as well. And then last but not least, I have Wattpad. And Wattpad is a story app and... Um, it's almost like Kindle, except for Wattpad has its own site, and it is a completely free site, free books, everything, and they, they're saying, oh, I got a text. Um, they're saying is that it's unlimited stories, because these stories are user-written and user-submitted, so it's not something you'll find in a bookstore. Um, it is my favorite site. I have an obsession with it. I've been obsessed with it for the past, maybe, like, two or three years now, and they finally got an, um an app like last year or so so I read it on the go it's really nice for reading on the go and I love it I'm currently reading my Wattpad love so if you get on the site you don't know what to read definitely check out my Wattpad love that's what I'm reading right now or if you guys want any suggestions I read like probably over over 200 books on there um, no joke because I'm always reading on that site and then I have my social folder the first thing I have is Tumblr Tumblr. Um, I call it Tumblr because why not? Why not use a British accent? Um, Tumblr is sort of like, I don't know, if you don't know what Tumblr is, just check it out. I have my own Tumblr. But um, yeah, you can look at your dash. You can post things and send messages and check your notifications and everything. Um, I'm at Heavenly Flashes on Tumblr. And then I have Twitter, which is fairly self explanatory. My Twitter is at point extra tweet. I will list all my social networks down below. If you did not already know them, they're usually listed on every video anyways. But yeah, I check my Twitter feed. So I'm always on Twitter, I'm always tweeting. And then I have Instagram. On Instagram I am princefessa 3 x which is self-explanatory because I based it off my YouTube mostly. So, Instagram. And I will link all those down below as well. Um, and then the next four are probably ones that you wouldn't really find on someone's cell phone. <laughs> the first one is Cacao Talk or Cacao. Sort of like Coco, but not Coco. <laughs> um, I call it cacao because that's just what sound what it sounds like cacao 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 maybe it's cacao <laughs> I don't I'm just failing um, talk and that is an I am service and um, I none of my friends have this none of them but um, I use it with. Sorry, I'm, I distracted for a second. Um, I use it with my Korean pen pal, my Uri Dong Sing, Uri Dong Sing, um, Taemin. And they told me to get this app to talk to them. So I got it for my pen pal, specifically only that person, because that's the only person I talk to on it. But it is, it's just an IM service. I don't know, can I even show you what it looks like? has really cute like smileys and stuff so it's just an IM service mostly for Korean people is, are mostly the people that use it but I've seen Americans that use it as well and then I have Voxer and Voxer is something that only me and Candace do I haven't met anybody else that does it it's a walkie talkie it's really awesome I'm gonna see if I can box Candace and get a response back Candace, I'm filming a video right now and I'm talking, I'm doing the what's on my iPhone tag, which you need to do, and I'm talking about Voxer, and I need you to um, Vox me back so I can show them how it works. And it records your message, and she, we were just texting, so maybe I'll get a Vox back in a few seconds. Um, and then I have Me Today, and Me Today is, once again, a blog that anyone can hold, but it's mostly for Korean people. Um, it's mostly Koreans that use it and Korean idols use it. It's a really famous blogging site in Korea. Um, and I have a Me Today, which I will list below again. If anybody's interested in signing up, I will help you sign up. They have an English site now, so it's not that hard, but I signed up back when it was only the Korean site. 
So that was a pain. But um, if you follow me on my Me Today, I only Me Today in Korean. So I don't know if that would bother anybody, but this is my Me Today. Can I even show you? I just posted a picture of myself. That's what my Me Today status says. It just says, um, I'm back again. Um, a lot of time has passed, right? That's what it says in Korean, if you're wondering. I don't know if you guys care or not. But anyways, me today. I have that as well under social. And then the last one I have under social is um, QQ. I call it Choo Choo because that just sounds like that's what it would be. Choo Choo instead of QQ. But if you were to type it in, it's just a Q and a Q. Um, this is a Chinese I aming thing. And this one is specifically for Chinese people because it's written in Chinese. So once again, you can get it if you don't, you know, know Chinese. But it's a bit of a pain to use if you don't know Chinese um, and I use this with my Chinese pen pal um, he told me to get it I got it we I am it's quite simple so I just got an I am from him as well oh nope that was like earlier today what's I am him back okay anyways um, so tutu is that and then under and then I have utilities as my next folder. I have settings, app store, Evernote, which is a note taking app. It's really awesome. I'm not gonna blab on about it, but it's my favorite app. It's also available on Android. Clock, because I use it for alarms. Um, reminders, because I use it for reminders. Mail, email, um, and then I have CoreLink, which CoreLink is actually T T M I K, um, but it's called CoreLink for some odd unknown reason, and um, it is the T T M I K official app and um, talk to me in Korean and um, it is just what I use when I'm studying Korean on the go because I am self teaching in Korean as I mentioned in my last video so um, it's really handy there are podcasts, PDF files, everything go to the next page and there are two folders and then newsstand which I hate that I can't delete that and I can't put it in a folder it's a bit of a pain um, if you guys know how to get rid of that somehow which I don't think there is a way but if you do let me know um, the first folder I have is other and basically I threw in every app in these two folders that I just don't use ever at all. Um, so I have videos, game center, well, I'm never going to get questions about this. I don't play games on my iPhone. Um, I've just never been a really big game person. I don't know why. I just don't like gaming on phones. I've never been a big fan of that so I have zero games on my iPhone. but. Videos, game center, music, iBooks, weather, maps, flashlight which is handy sometimes, notes and super pages, which is like white pages for, white pages if you live in America, if you know what white pages are, um, for your phone. And then other two, which has iTunes, voice memos, contacts, quick video, which is sort of like a video chatting service that I plan to use my sister. She has the Samsung Epic, so she doesn't have, or the Galaxy, I don't know. Um, so she doesn't have, you know, FaceTime, so we use quick instead, um, which is QIK. I'll list all the apps below. Um, campus, calculator, stocks, and calendar. Um, so that is it for what's on my iPhone. Hopefully this wasn't too boring to watch. Um, but I am ecstatic that I finally have an iPhone. Um, it really is such an improvement from every other phone that I've ever owned. Um, which I feel like a hypocrite because I used to trash on iPhone. I still don't really like the company that much just because uh, I think they have some dirty tricks up their sleeve when it comes to sort of being dominant in the phone field you can look it up maybe I'm just a um, conspirator but I will always be an Android girl at heart but I finally have an iPhone so I have turned Apple in that aspect but um, yeah that is basically it for the thing, it doesn't look like she's going to vox me back anytime soon. Because she hates me. But, yeah. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have an iPhone, tell me what your favorite apps are. Because I'm always looking to try new apps, delete apps, and see how that goes. Um, or do this video. Um, I don't know who all that I'm friends with here on YouTube or talk to here on YouTube has an iPhone. Um, except for, I know Candace has an iPhone, so Candace, if you don't film this now, I will hit you. I'm, I'm talking to you, Candace. Um, so I'm going to try and get Candace to film it, so I tag, surprise Owen style, Candace. Um, and then, I don't know, Chelsea, do you, have a, do you have an iPhone, Chelsea? 
Um, I'm also going to tag Kawan Pun Chelsea because I don't know if she has an iPhone. If you have an Android, film it too. But anyways, um, that is it. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video about my iPhone. Um, and yeah. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, send your requests, and I will see you guys later.